The, um, oh gosh, and then uh, we got great news. Um, this program will not be, will not be distributed by the Blaze. <laughs> because we are not a conservative program. And there are only conservative programs on the Blaze Network. Like Steven Crowder. Uh, this is also uh, the network uh, that um, launched, in, well, they merged with the thing that launched uh, Gavin McGinnis. And of course, Tommy Lauren, although she got booted because she was pro-choice, if I'm not mistaken. Because of small government. And they have a bunch of other uh, conservatives on there, like, uh, oh, that new guy they have, that conservative Dave Rubin. So uh, congratulations to Dave Rubin. Dave, I don't want to take anything away from you because I know that you've worked hard for this. And uh, obviously you, um, I would imagine through the various Coke affiliate networks, word got out that David Coke may not have uh, too much longer to um, spread uh, horridness competition would start kicking in <laughs> through cash uh, gifts and maybe uh, you heard it was time for you to move uh, to get a little more aggressive with the book coming out I just want to say that I you I you deserve most of this credit <laughs> but I also got to say that I think you're deciding to just come out as a conservative and, and watch out for that Steven Crowder there because he loves to make fun of the gays. But um, you're coming out as a conservative. I feel like in some small way, I helped you. And um, I want you to know that makes me feel good. So congrats to you. And if I do say so myself, congrats uh, to me um, because I feel like, you know, I helped you in some way see your true essence. And there's nothing that makes us happier here. I think we all basically participate, obviously, in helping. We uh, support true essence. There's nothing that is more gratifying to all of us here than to see someone come into their own like you have. So it was supposed to be after 2020. Kudos. My whole yeah. timeline was sped up. Well, that's good. I mean, uh, good for you. And you know what that means? Uh, you guys will sell a ton of books. Um, just uh, especially some large purchases, I imagine. Yeah, I and mean, there may be some uh, big purchases. Do you have those book purchasing deals? <laughs> but that's pretty good. Uh, uh, so, seems uh, to me that abortion. I've thought about it intellectually, and it's wrong. Right? Do you oh, have a bulk I, purchasing? I, deal? Oh, that was the other thing. Is that yeah, um, Dave? Uh, would you mind sending me a heads up? on when you're going to announce that you're fully now uh, anti-abortion. Because you've been pretending a little bit like you've been walking down this road. I would imagine these negotiations have been going on for a while. That may have been the big stumbling block, or maybe you and Glenn worked like, out. Like, We're not sure, actually, that the bulk purchase is going to work. Ooh, it seems to me like women should be able to choose uh, this whole their own This body. whole post-birth abortion <laughs> thing is really problematic. I, I just can't support uh, people who support killing live people. So, uh, no. I mean, except for unless it's, you know. Except other, for unless my the unless, book thing's not Unless they're through. Palestinian. Like, okay, uh, well, but. Uh, and they could be aborted when they're adults, too. This is about the ideas. I thought, how can I organize ideas? And I need a giant chalkboard with Ilhan Omar right in the middle <laughs> of it. And Glenn's got one of well, those. Well, as I said last night, he needs a boss. He definitely <laughs> needs direction. And whatever else you say about Glenn Beck, I think he's able to provide a form of direction. Yep. Uh